junior from Perry. So big thing to start out here. Mackle. Corey Shee, LaSalle, Cincinnati LaSalle, Avery Zirkel, head coach Alex Mackle Walsh, Mackle in the red ankle band, She in the red socks and the green ankle band. He has his back to you, he's got the black singlet on, Mackle in the white singlet. And she loves wrestling from the seat belt position. Mackle looking to go behind here. And Mackle in on a left-handed head inside single leg. She tries to do a little bit of a jelly roll. Catches the leg. Nice scramble. If he's going to try and pass the foot or not, I do not know. Mackle can't seem to do anything with it. When there's, no, he's getting two. They give two up. Not really sure that was two. She, yeah, now that's two. Okay, I get it. Mackle. The Walsh Warrior lives in Austin Town, Ohio. He's got quite the drive. She is out. 2-1, Alex Mackle. And follow that story up with the teams. The team uh, race right now, there's Clovis and Perry head-to-head -head for third place at 120. I think if Clovis wins that, it's all but over. Mackle down underneath. Front headlock for she. She, Cincinnati LaSalle, the freshman. Tries to go bowling for dollars there. Throw by off the front hat, unable to do anything with it. And end of the first period, 2 1 lead, Mackle. She's choice. He's going to go down. And she's out right away. We're tied at two. And Alliance. Top Gun 2014 final. 120 pounds. Ninth grader versus a tenth grader. Corey She. There he goes. He loves this. Two takedown She. I don't know why they're not calling it. It's a two. Over tie. Shuck by. And now Mackle trying to get out of it. She, oh, and there's a Peterson attempt by Mackle. And Mackle going Iranian on him. And nothing yet. Two reversal, there it is. 4-4 four, four now. Five four. she up on Mackle right now. And there's some good action right now. And 5-4 now. And there's a shot by Mackle. Head inside, left hand. And they're going to break that one potentially. And there's a shot. There's a barrel roll. Two. Looking for near falls. And she's getting swipes. Oh, man. He's going to have a 9-4 lead. That was huge at the end of the second period with two seconds left. And there it is. She.
er, and now we're back to action. 9-4. She, he's dominating thus far. And Mackle needs an escape and some big points. He's trying to do like a fat man roll, step over. Hook and roll, if you will. She locking his arms, doing that side headlock, Merkel deal. The James Fleming snapper type stuff. And Mackle's coming out. She loves that position. Holy smokes. And there's a reversal for Mackle. Nine. Nine six now. And there's a stall warning on the bottom, man, on she. 46 seconds left. Mackle's going to get reversed here. Eleven six she and eleven six Mackle. Was this Gaten and Bennett over here? Newhouse and Gaten and wow, Newhouse is gonna uh, put. Oh wow, there's a roll. Is he gonna catch him? No. She's gonna hang on. Thirty seconds left. And Mackle's trying to do the old Jordan Oliver wizard kick through, and it's just not going to work. He's down by five. As Newhouse picks up a big win for Perry over there. Mackle needs a big reversal with backs. He's not going to get it, judging by how this guy is really tough on top. And that's huge. The uh, freshman is nails, folks. Corey She, write him down, write his name down. Corey She's the real deal. Holyfield, coached by Avery Zirkle.